Hello guys, trailer 1 is out as you probably saw. Today I would like to analyze the trailer and talk about few more things. Let's start. Trailer starting with new island that is not in Toho Land. So there's will be more than one new island. To be honest absolutely don't know what is the Thailand. If this island have anything to do with any island from Anim. I guess that's Kuregana, but in my opinion that's just randomly created island like Graveyard or Magna Island. Now there we can see obvious reference to legendary fight between Odin and Kato, and everything is starting now. First what they showing us is Electro V1 reworked, that's the only one fighting style reworked there, so hard to save other fighting styles V1 getting reworked too. Every Electro moves on this trailer looks like absolutely buffed versions of actual moves. Next is bomb rework probably, because every move of that thing looks like an explosion right, visual of it looks sick as hell. Next is spike reworked, as we can see, but to be honest I'm thinking if it's not an awakening, because spike and anim don't have power to make spikes on terrain and Paramecia Awakenings have power to operate on the ground. We can see move that looks like spin, but it's not spin. Look at Indra hands, he have spikes on them, it's still spike fruit. Literally they didn't show us spin there as everyone think. And this move that was mysterious for a while, everyone was wondering if it's Doe Awakening or Spike, but now we know this move is Spike or Work Awakening. Next one is Chop. Moves of Chop looks like these in One Piece Warriors 4. All parts of Indra body spining and heating enemy. There's a move that grabbing enemy too from distance. And except of Chop Punch we got Chop Barrage. There's finally Chop Fly 2. And these slashes at the end. Well I don't know if that's still Chop. Maybe it's move with buggy knives. Next is Smoke Rework or Awakening hard to say because they announced Awakenings in trailer but then they showed Smoke and Quake V1. Smoke rework have moves that more looks like smoke clouds. There's something like wind tornado but to be honest IDK what is that? The last one move looks like smoke flight that dropping smoke bombs or IDK what is that? And now we can see Quake V1 rework. Why it's Quake V1? Because these moves looks worse than Awakening 1, these moves are absolutely reworked moves of V1. Spring will work, in my opinion moves looks same as before, but with more effects, except last one, Spring Hopper, looks faster, with bigger range, just absolutely better. Next is Dark V1 rework, finally we got on this fruit tree all one liberation, but don't really know concept of these rocks throwing, other moves looks just like so much better version of Dark actual moves. Next is Magma V1, finally looks like Magma not red thing, moves are obvious worse than Awaken ones, smaller and probably with less DMG, but still so much better than actual Magma V1. Next we have Flame V1 rework, if we are talking about that green move, because some people thinks it's barrier or revive, nope, it's flame move that Ace was using, green fireflies, coming back to trailer, moves of reworked flame V1 looks godly, hopefully flame will get flame DMG like soul, buddy sword Dan Ringoku have, so enemy will burn after getting hit by flame. Next we got Ice Rework, there's something like Ice Tornado, Ice Moves looks so much cleaner, and Ice Bird looks like real bird not only Ice Statue. And now we're going for probably best part of trailer. New Fruit is Leopard, and Gum getting rework on base attacks and gear second, finally first steps for Gum to get more gears in the future. First about Leopard, 
we can see on trailer that first move off course what it have is transform, Z move, probably like Buddha, without transform we can't do anything, first attack that leopard have is raw, X move, probably full AOE attack. As I taught other attacks are just Luxy advanced Rakushiki fighting style enhanced by the speed and strength of the leopard, we can see finger pistol barrage, shigen barrage, C move, air kick, rank Iku, maybe tap move, that have yellow color, there's move that makes slashes near leopard user and then makes beam, probably Riku again, V move, if I see well leopard have better Soru, it have yellow color there, and last one move is absolutely leopard charge with yellow effect, F move it looks like huge dash, next one is Gomru work, we can see their gear second, but it's obvious that base moves getting it too, first what we can see is jet pistol it moreover, it is longer, and so much faster, user and gear second moves so much faster as it should, imagine gear second plus minkrace monker s, gatling move looks cleaner and bigger too, didn't saw bazooka but I guess it's better too, and btw gum finally getting back rocket move as f move, you will see that later in video. Rakushiki V2, God Human, all those moves looks like better version of actual, I don't know very much what I should comment on here. Cursed Dual Kartana, first what we can see is Big Slash a tornado that looks similar to Hello Scythe Z move, but so much better, next we have move that looks like this move when Odin charging into Kato, absolutely sick. And finally probably new gun, Soul Guitar, first move is Soul Beam. Second one is legit soul king form, that I wanted for revive awakening or something like that. I'm totally curious that gun getting this power instead of fruit, can't wait to use it in the game. And the last what we can see in trailer is new sea look and boats effect, absolutely nice. Next trailer and last one with release date in Sunday and by this week we can say that last sneak peek will be about Do Awakening. ZLs did absolutely good work with trailer, but there's few more things. Stage? There was stage few hours after trailer, but that was 5am for me and I was sleeping. So found on Discord someone who said what they was talking about. First thing, no, gum not getting anything else in this update than rework on base moves and gear second. Fruits beside door and something else getting only revamp. Race Awakening, God Human and CDK aren't gonna be obtainable through anything we used to. Multiple fruits getting M1S including Do Awakening. Next things are these sneak peeks that they posted before trailer. We can see their Flame Fire Emperor move rework, Dark Liberation move rework, and there we go, these cold tornadoes. So many people thinks it's Yuki Yuki no me, but in my opinion absolutely no. Indra on this screen holding something like Ice Trident, it's nearly obvious that's Ice Rework. And they're changing Ice Sword with Ice Trident. Last one is like I said before, Gom Rocket, finally Gum getting F move that everyone wanted. 
Last thing is that funny wit by Win Loco. At the first time I huff it's have nothing to do with blocks fruits, then he said that's have something to do. So I absolutely didn't know what's that mean. But now as you can see we know that all these colors was sneak peek for leopard. Yes, all these five colors. And that's actually it. I think I will do next analyze with last trailer. Can't wait for that. Thanks for watching and bye.